adding and subtracting integers. Integers are whole numbers, negative and positive, and zero. So zero, positive, and negative whole numbers are integers. To add two integers, let's take a look at the first example. Three plus negative six. We can use one way to solve this one is using the number line. Number line is here, we have a number line. So we want to add negative six to three. So if you go to three here, this point here is three. And when it says plus negative six, means that move six units to the left. One, two, three, four, five, and six. The answer is negative three. Negative three is the answer. So when you add a negative integer to a positive integer, you just need to move from right to left on number line. This is one way to solve it. But if you have two integers with different signs, this one is positive three and this one is negative six, just find the difference. The difference of six and three is three. And then put the sign of the bigger number. Negative six is not bigger than three, but if you ignore the signs, six is bigger than three. So what is the sign of six? Is negative. So the answer is negative three. Let's take a look at the next example. Negative five plus negative two. If you go to negative five here, on number line, negative five, you need to write, you need to go to the left side. So to go to the left side, just go to negative five, negative five is here, and it says negative two means that two units to the left. So the answer is negative seven. If you add two integers with the same sign, if it is positive, we know that two plus five is seven. If they are negative, then put the sign of negative. So two plus seven is, is two plus five is seven, and the sign of both of them is negative. If they have the same sign, just add them up and put the sign. If they have different signs, find the difference and put the sign of the bigger number. Let's take a look at the next example here. Seven plus negative four. If you go to uh, number line here, seven is this point, and if you go four units to the left, one, two, three, four, the answer is three. You can also find the difference of seven and four, it is three. The bigger number seven is positive, so put a positive sign, or you don't need to put positive four. Positive numbers, we don't write the sign. Let's take a look at the next one. 46 plus negative 15. These two have different signs. 46 is positive and negative 15 is negative. So first find the difference. The difference of 46 and 15 is 31. The bigger number is 46 and it is positive. So it is positive 31. Next one. These two, they have the same sign. So put the sign, add them up. 12 plus eight is 20. So the answer is negative 20. 39 plus negative 18, the, the, these two have different signs. This one is positive, this one is negative. So find the difference. The difference of 39 and 18 is 21. The bigger number here is 39 and it is positive. So the answer is positive 21.